Okay, I thought I'd do another one of these videos. Uh, I made a video like this before a long time ago. It's basically where I talk about game movies that I actually saw in the movie theater. And this is a time now when a lot of people are not even going to movie theaters. And that's a whole different topic that I don't even want to get into. It's a very mixed feeling topic. But basically I want to talk about the good experiences I had in theaters. And um, this story takes place in San Francisco. And San Francisco has this um, gay neighborhood called the Castro. And in the Castro, there's a theater, a historic theater, beautiful theater, called the Castro Theater. And me and my friend, we went to this film festival and they were showing a movie there that night, and it was called Tab Hunter Confidential. And now we know nothing about Tab Hunter. We didn't know the long history of it. And basically, he's this famous Hollywood star from the 50s and 60s that was this major heartthrob for people. And it was later revealed that he was gay, or he came out as gay later in his life. And this theater, I mean, maybe seats 500, 800 people, and it was packed. It was absolutely packed. And not to discriminate, but the majority of the people were older gay men. I mean, we looked around and we were the only people like in our 20s. And so it was really strange, but we felt like they were there for a reason, like they had some kind of prior history. So the movie plays on and it's a great movie. I highly recommend it, very educational. It teaches you about his life and how he had to be secretly gay and all the people he was dating and all that stuff. Really interesting movie. But the big twist of the night came after the movie when someone came up on a microphone and said, ladies and gentlemen, Tab Hunter. And the whole crowd just stood up in this roarous applause, you know, for this guy. And, he, and there he is, he shows up, Tab Hunter himself in the flesh. And I look at my friend and he looks back at me and we just sort of like smile because we don't know. We didn't know like this, this, this predated us, you know, before we, we were even born, there was this whole thing about this guy and this whole gay, gay you know, lusting after this man. And, and then to see everybody there, you know, it felt like we were a part of it, even if it was the concluding part of the, their story, you know, the camaraderie of it, to be in there and, and have, to see all, the, all their feelings be validated because this guy was also gay. And you can't get that experience at home. If you watch that movie, it was a different layer of, of depth that you just can't experience at home. And it was a great gay experience and there really was nothing like it.